The CUNY system has a number of great film programs that let aspiring filmmakers follow their dreams. Urban U found one filmmaker from Brooklyn College whose short film, Catch Up, is just one gem to come out of these programs. Two, three. I think that the way kids experience time is overlooked. <laughs> Even little things that you don't think a kid would pick up on or understand, they are experiencing it as well in their own way. And that's kind of what I wanted this movie to be about, is just how kids <laughs> experience things and pass time. How time passes through a kid's eyes, because it's slow. It's super slow, and it doesn't make sense when people don't explain things to you, so you kind of make your own conclusions about things. Kids are interesting. Kids are interesting, and if we just paid attention to them a little more, they'd have. A, I think they have a lot to say and a lot of insight on situations like being foreclosed on. Haley's short film fits in with a trend in films like Nomadland and books like Evicted, stories about families who are struggling with economic upheaval. I kind of just wanted to hone in on that um, feeling of being a kid and your parents are working nine to five or longer in most cases, I would say these days. The story isn't about the parents. It's about something that's happening to the parents, sure. But the kids at school are with her friends majority of the time. So I wanted to kind of showcase that. Here, Jimmy, do you want my fruit snacks? Ketchup, what is now ketchup, was the only idea that I had that stemmed from my own life. Who's gonna take care of Judy? I mean, this is insane. Ketchup tells a story of a family going through foreclosure through the eyes of the main character, June. I wanted to say what happened to me as a kid and kind of get that therapeutic aspect out of it, writing it however many years later. But I also wanted to have it be a, a, an enjoyable story and a movie to watch. So I made your lunch, it's in the fridge, it's bologna again. I'm sorry, I just haven't had time to get to the store. I actually filmed it in the house that my dad grew up in, which was in Princeton, New Jersey. And he, my uncle, my dad's twin brother, played Michael, the dad. So it hit very close to home on all fronts. Don't tell mom. Who likes bologna anyway? <laughs> As a young girl, June's perspective is vital to the film's story. It was definitely 100% intentional to juxtapose adult life and innocent kid life. I mean, it hits you like a brick <laughs> when something like that happens. I would say that ketchup in all the film is probably about like 80 to 85% true um, from taken from my own life directly. Haley has made three short films and worked on a music video, but the crew on Catch Up was unique in one very distinct way. My entire crew was all female from pre-production to post-production. It was entirely made by women, uh, which I felt really proud about. I've never felt more supported on set in my entire life. I've never felt more heard. It was just like being comfortable to turn around and have a conversation and open dialogue with everybody about whatever their job was and just be honest and, and we could just really get things done. I've never um, been in an environment like that. And as for the title? I actually just love ketchup. <laughs> as a kid, I've loved ketchup. My favorite condiment by far. For Urban U, I'm Craig Thompson. <laughs>